We've been hearing from a lot of doctors lately who cannot stress enough the importance of getting your kids vaccinated. But of most of the measles cases in our area, the kids did get the vaccine. Our Lauren Tallarico has been looking into this today. So Lauren, what gives? Well, that's the question we've been hearing from people. So we took that question to an expert who broke it down. There are three confirmed cases of measles here in Harris County. Tonight about a measles outbreak Here's across another the case Houston of the measles area. An outbreak of measles here in and Houston. There's another and possible downward. case of measles Five in Harris New County. Measles cases seven in seven Houston cases area in total in the state. In less than two weeks, a measles outbreak across greater Houston has brought this once thought eliminated disease front and center. Texas is really uh, ripe territory for an outbreak because of our um, high non-vaccinated rate. An outbreak that Dr. Katherine Troisi, an epidemiologist at UT Health School of Public Health, says was just a matter of time. It's really a tragedy because measles is a preventable disease and the best thing to do is to vaccinate. Out of the six Houston area cases under investigation, we know four of the five children were vaccinated. So why didn't it work? It may be genetics. And there may be something about your immune response that it won't respond to the vaccine. If the vaccine isn't given at the right ages, that also can affect whether it protects you or not. And then if the vaccine hasn't been stored properly. Online, one person wondered if the virus has mutated. The vaccine has been around since the 60s. The virus has not changed in all that time. Dr. Troisi says the reason it hasn't is a bit of a medical mystery. Viruses have either RNA or DNA as their genetic material. If they have RNA, they are more likely to change. Measles is an RNA virus, but it is very stable. And because of that, the vaccine works. Without it, a person who comes in contact with the virus has a 90% chance of getting the measles. And remember, with the vaccine, you have a 7 to 3% chance of getting it. So that is a big difference yeah. compared to 90. Yeah. Easy to weigh the odds there. Yes. Thank you, Lauren.